Well, breakthrough artist Mitchell Tenpenny hit the top spot on the country charts with his single Drunk Me back in December. The hit song and its writers were honored at a number one bash right here in Nashville, and that's where Tenpenny told our Adam Wardsell the achievement is a childhood dream come true. Mitchell Tenpenny has a big reason to celebrate, big reason for a celebratory drink, Drunk Me, this man's first number one hit. He joins us now here on Nashville Insider. Mitchell, good to see you. Congratulations. Man, glad to be here. Thank you, brother. Appreciate it. I've been sober, cause there ain't no hangover like you. When you first heard that this song is a number one, and it was climbing the charts, but when you heard yeah. this song is number one, what went through your mind? Where were you? What did it feel like? I, I don't know. It was just so many emotions flooding in at once. This is something I've dreamed about since I was a little kid. And growing up in Nashville, I've been to a million of these number ones, just hoping maybe one day I could do that. And I don't know. It was just such a long year and a long process to get that chance. And I was just so grateful, just overcome, made a million phone calls, just thanking everybody for for giving me that. Now when you hear a title like Drunk Me, I mean quintessential country song title, where were you when you wrote this song and how did it come about? Yeah, right down uh, across the street in my buddy's studio, um, who also produced my record, Jordan Schmidt, and I just want to write that song about someone who might need to quit drinking for a little bit to stand a chance of getting over somebody, and I didn't know how serious it was going to become or how real the song was going to become, but that's the magic of co-writing, and we all kind of shared our stories and what we've been through and ended up writing that song that day and it was just one of those moments in the room where it just, it worked out. What's the message for the exes that have had a couple drinks and it's three o'clock in the morning and they do something maybe they shouldn't? What's the message? Put your phone down. <laughs> Absolutely put your phone down. Nothing good happens after midnight. No. Hold, hold on one second, I'm getting a call. Hey, alcohol you later. That's a segue. Alcohol you later. On country radio nice. right now, yeah. I, I sense a theme in these singles. Yeah, so, and I was kind of nervous about doing two drinking songs at the same time, but again, Alcohol You Later wasn't even going to make the record, let alone a single, but we, as we kept touring and as Drunk Me kept doing his thing, the crowd just kept singing it back and, and asking for it, and it, at some point you just got to listen. And so it ended up making the record, and then it just kept getting bigger and bigger at shows, and ended up making a single. It's just crazy to know the, the lifespan of a song from when you write it. I mean, that song's like five years old, so as it's ventured on its way all the way up to country radio, it's just kind of crazy to think of when I was in that room that day that it would be where it is now. And now it's reborn. Come on, man, I love it. Last question, uh, your full length album, which is amazing, it's out now uh, telling all my secrets. So yeah. we need to know any secrets that people might not know about Mitchell Tenpenny. Oh man, I mean, I think I exposed a lot of them out there. I do love a good long bath though. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a warm water kind of guy, so at the end of the day, I know that's kind of not really a secret, but I love to get in a nice bubble bath. Man. There you go, Mitchell Tenpenny, otherwise known as Mr. Bubbles. Mr. Yeah. Bubbles, thank you so Appreciate much. Appreciate it, brother. Thank you so much. You can catch breakout star Mitchell Tenpenny on the Make It Sweet tour with Old Dominion through May. Thanks so much for watching this week's Nashville Insider feature. If you liked what you saw, be an insider and hit the subscribe button. And also check out our friends Wilson Fairchild on their YouTube channel. And if you want to see full episodes of Nashville Insider, go to countryroadtv.com and use the code INSIDER when you sign up to get a free month. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you next week.